Hello everyone, Finn and Flask here. So this summer I've been a little slow with putting up videos because I've been having a lot of projects and kind of remodeling my, my camp. I've got a few projects from the camp that I'm bringing home to finish. And one of them I'm gonna share with you today. So I got this right here. This is a bear rug that my father ended up picking up a few years back. And it's actually kind of a funny story. I was out clamming with my father and my uncle in Plymouth. And the neighbor had this bear rug for sale. And we ended up purchasing it. Uh, you can see it's not in the greatest condition. It's got bear spots and stuff like that. So we got it for a pretty good... Uh, for a pretty good price and my father was trying to hide it from my mother so we had it in a bag and he stuffed it behind our gun cabinet and my father forgot it was my mother's birthday and my mother was all pissed off at him and said uh i can't believe you forgot my birthday you didn't get me anything my father's like i got you something go behind the gun cabinet and she pulled it out and you know it was kind of a funny thing it was pretty cool but so this rug is not actually in the greatest of condition and I want to do something with it to make it a little more presentable. So what I'm thinking about doing is, because the head's in pretty good shape, I'm thinking about taking the backing off and making a pack mount for it. So I'm just going to make a simple pack mount. And I also have this really, really awesome moose shed that my dog found. And I'm going to try to incorporate this into the mount as well. And I think it'll look really good when it's done. So, let's begin. I'm going to... It seems to be really... put on here. So, I'm just going to do my best and get this mount freed. Here we go. I think it looks so much better as is. So I went out in the yard and I picked up this little piece of blow down material. I'm gonna make a little frame as though you made it just to pack out with it. So I got some twine and I'm going to wrap four corners with it. All right, so I got this little frame I have it wound up like this. I'm gonna pop a couple screws in here so that it'll stay. But you really don't get to see too much of the antler. So I might flip it around and have this come a little higher. And this come a little lower. I think that's a bit better. I don't have a lot of good rope, so I'm gonna try to hide this rope right here. I really don't wanna screw 
the shed and You hide all that bareness, and I think I can probably just put one rope right across the front of this. All right, so I'm gonna take this right here. And I think that looks pretty freaking good. I'm pretty happy with this. I think this is going to look really good up at the camp. Thank you very much for watching. Mm -hmm.